you. <laughs> <laughs> Hello guys. Hi Everton. Hi your local gender. How are you doing guys? Hi, yeah, how I am? I am okay. I'm a bit tired. <laughs> I have I had quite busy days in the past week. Um but I'm pretty excited because you know Sumeru Nahida new Oregon quest. I'm very excited about all those things. Um, I'm definitely gonna start by pulling Konahida. We do, I, I'm trying to maintain my expectations low because although I have a lot of wishes, I am not guaranteed and I haven't really wished much. I only did 10 wishes after I got Ganyu accidentally <laughs> last time, so... I have those wishes, but I need to win the 50-50 or some golden needs to come over um, early. Oh, hey! Everybody is subscribed! Oh my god, a tier 1 for 4 months already? Thank you so much! I really appreciate that! Thank you! Thank you, thank you! Yeah, for everyone who's watching on YouTube, I'm also streaming on Twitch. And yeah, that, that's what I'm reacting to, so everything just uh, subscribed and Twitch for the fourth month already. That's insane. That's really cool. Thank you. But yeah, so I'm I'm really excited about pulling for Nahida, but at the same time, I'm I'm not looking super excited because I'm trying to keep my expectations low because if I don't win the 50-50, I do not have any money. <laughs> so unfortunately, if I don't win, I'm not gonna get her. I'll have to farm for Primal Gems during the update. Um well actually I only have 15 days, so I'm tr I'll keep my expectations low, but let's pray I can get her. Um, let me just go to a nicer place. Where should the where should we go to pull? I just want to start pulling right away. Because I really want to get her. She looks cracked. She is so cute. She's a little fairy. I love her design. Um, I've already put navigation here to um, fight the dendro hypostasis so we can level her up as much as possible today. I did pre-farm most of the things. There are just a few flowers missing. And of course we have the new Archon quest, we have the Serenity pod, which is that one. I am absolutely insanely excited about. I love the teapot. You know, I'm a teapot main. I really want to try that. Um, but yeah, should we go to Vanarana? I feel like Vanarana is a good place to summon for Nahida. Yeah, to a tree. Let's go to a Vanarana tree. I feel like this is a nice place. Don't you think? Does the onion count as a tree? Or should they go like there? 
with the Anorana singing. Maybe. Oh, that's the perfect spot, right? I'll pull, I'll pull for her here. I think that's the nicest spot to pull. Should we start? <sighs> okay, so... Oh, I can buy one more. Amazing. I have literally 160 Prima Gems. <laughs> what are the chances? Okay, so I have exactly 100 wishes. And I'm not guaranteed. Let's pray for an early PD or for an Ahida right away. Or even better, for an Ahida early PD with Constellation. That, that will be even more amazing. I don't care about anyone here in the banner. I already have C5 banner. I don't care about Razor like you guys already know. And I already have C20 Noel, so I'm fine. It's nice. Yeah, it's a good place, right? Okay, wish me luck. Let's see what happens. <laughs> I'm actually nervous. Okay, let's go. Let's just start. Okay. These are 20 or 30 wishes, I'm sure. I don't really care about the four stars, like I was saying. I actually prefer a weapon. <laughs> oh, what? What? Okay, I'll take it. We started well. We started well. Shinobu is not even in the banner. That's amazing. That's actually amazing. I've spent so many wishes trying to get Shinobu constellations. That was unexpected. Okay. Good banner. Already like Nahida a lot. What the fuck? No way. This is like 30 or 40, guys. This is early pity. After getting a Shinobu. Oh my god. Oh, of course it's the look. For fuck's sake. I got happy. I got happy too early. <laughs> but at least we got a guarantee Nahida. And we still have 90 wishes. So we're fine. We're all good. And a, another banner. Okay, that's fine. Maybe we'll even activate Venice Constellation. Just because, you know. It's been a long time. I'm feeling crazy. Maybe we'll get it. Okay. Let's, let's keep going. It's fine. Let's hope for an another early PD because I really, really, really want Scaramouche. And Scaramouche looks amazing. And I don't know how I'm gonna get 90 more wishes to get him. Unless we get like an Ahida and another. Okay, another Bennett. That's fine. Okay. Do I get coins? Oh, yeah, I get coins. When, um. When it's a like when I already reached C6, even if I didn't activate it. Okay, I would accept another Shinobu or whatever. Okay, I'm gonna skip the whole thing. Noel, sacrificial bow. I'm happy about that. Good weapon. <sighs> it's so sad to see the wishes going away. <laughs> it's really depressing. Fuck the look, man. Oh my god, I hate the look so much. <laughs> He's one of my least, like, liked characters. He's, like, really on the bottom of the list for me. I like his gameplay, but I don't like his personality, if that makes sense. Kind of like Ayato. Although, I, I feel like I like Ayato's personality. After his story quest, I started liking him. Oh no. We really gotta spend all my wishes. I'm poor. I'm broke. I didn't mean. <laughs> oh, why do you look? <laughs> That was not the time, you look. That was not the time. Enough of Noel. I, I can't. I can't look at Noel anymore. Maybe if it gives me these, like weapons, I'll be happy. Okay, no problem. <sighs> I don't even know which wish we are now. I'm gonna skip all that. Another Noel. May I swear, I'm probably like C13 Noel now. I'm not even joking. I'll, I'll look at my stats later. Because I have got so many Noels in this account already. Oh, it's not golden. My wishes are <laughs> almost over. Oh, no. I'm getting I'm getting a bit stressed. 
okay, okay. Give me a, a sword or something. No, okay. Another Noel, amazing. It's there's really like a Noel banner. Oh, guys, I was happy too early. Am I really gonna spend everything and not get Nahida? Although I'm close, it's fine. It's fine, it's fine. I'm close. It should be like 10 or 20 wishes more, right? This is so lucky. I can't believe. I'm usually really lucky with these. My time has come. I think now it's her. Oh, finally. <laughs> Give me two Nahidas, please. Or like something to guarantee Skarmush, please. Oh, girly. Oh my god. So much effort. <laughs> I'm really happy, but I literally have zero wishes now. Oh, please, another gold win, please. No, not Bennett. Oh. <laughs> That's great. Okay, at least I got her, right? Um, How long do we have until Scaramouche? Like a month? Can I get like 90 wishes? before a month actually like technically you would need 180 wishes because oh bro look at this <laughs> zero private gems zero wishes i've never been so broke and i was lying to myself thinking i would get her early pd i even put the charge here for the weapon i was like ah, i'm gonna get her he did i'm gonna get her weapon for sure <sighs> Okay. Whoa, at least I'm rich now because of all the Noels. I can even buy like a Lisa. I don't think I need though. I already have many constellations for Lisa. I'll save for Kaya because I really want his next constellation. Oh, the Aranara spot didn't work. <laughs> oh my god. Scaramouche. It's fine. Okay, let's let's enjoy. Let's enjoy the Archon. Let's let's see her. Let's see the girly. Oh my god, she's so cute. She's absolutely adorable. Oh my god, she's so adorable. Hi Lucy, how are you doing? Welcome to the stream. How are you? Hotman's friend. <laughs> true, true. Okay. Why doesn't it feel like a win? It doesn't feel like a win. Today was not my day. I'm getting smarter. Okay. I have a lot of XP paper. Where did this all come from? Beth is keeping her dialogue. But it's fine. Let's see how much more we can level her up. I think I need more dendro hypostasis. Yep, I need three more. Oh well, maybe we can get. Oh, let me put her on the party. Uh, She's so cute. What? She's like the same size as an Aranara. <laughs> Where is the long Aranara there? Oh my god, the Aranara is bigger than her. <laughs> She's so tiny. <laughs> so cute. Okay, so. I don't really know how to build her properly yet. So I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna put the... Mm, actually... I know that the Wisif is probably better for her overall because of the critical damage and also the elemental mastery. But I think I'll probably put the Lost Prayer to Sacred Wounds just because it's a 5 star and it gives critical weight so it's fine. And also increases like the movement speed so I think that's good because she's small so she's gonna be really slow. Um, at least for running and dodging so I think I'm gonna put the Lost Prayer for now. But I'll probably change like if obviously if we don't have the Lost Prayer I would recommend the Wisif because you can get like elemental damage, you can get elemental mastery, which is really good. And you already have the critical damage substat. Um, okay. Talents. Can we level up the talents a little bit? Okay, 90%. And 
let's equip the artifacts. So I have a bunch of artifacts on Barbara, like the usual. I didn't really know what to equip, if it was gonna be better, the Deep Woods or the... What's the name of the other one? Gilded Dreams, is I... Yeah. I didn't know if the Deep Wood or Gilded Dreams are gonna be better, but I farmed the domain so much that I have both. I just leveled up these one first, just because it seemed like it would be good. Mastery, and then I didn't go there with bonus, and then critical ray. Oh, wait, critical damage? Oh, no, yeah, yeah, true, true, true. Okay, critical damage, that's fine. Okay, let's see her situation. Okay, good crit ray and crit damage could be better, but it's fine. We have quite a bit of elemental mastery, better than I was expecting from my build. Okay, okay, I can do the I can do with that. That's fine. So let me add her to all the parties. Oh, look at her! Oh my god, so cute. Oh my goodness, she's so freaking adorable. So let me see. Oh, this party is gonna be amazing. I'm just waiting for Lila now. Oh, I need wishes for Lila. in a tough situation here um and bloom party bloom party is gonna be op because all the op characters are in bloom party okay i think i've added her to all my parties yeah i have this friendship party but that's just for making um daily commissions and stuff that's just because when you do daily commissions, you get a lot of friendship points. Oh, let me take a picture. She's too adorable. And that's why I have like my friendship team. So Ningguang, Kale, well, Ningguang and Shangling, they are not built up in any way. They are super weak. Kali is relatively okay, and Mahida is going to be okay as well. But um, they are just there to raise the friendship points because I want all the character cards just for fun. Hi, Adriana. Kakot's gang. Let's go. Hey, Wisteria. Hey Nap Nap, welcome to the stream, guys. Wait, let me let me read the chat a little bit because I, I missed some messages. That's an archon. Yes, she's the dendro archon. She is a child because the dendro archon. Well, actually, should I tell you? It's a spoiler. Well, something happened to the dendro archon, and now that it's a child. Yeah. But I quite I don't like child characters most of the time but, but in her case like it's fine for me personally because i feel like she looks like a fairy and i really like fairies and stuff so i feel like it fits her design i'm, I'm fine with it i would prefer i'd rather her to be like an adult like a like a wong but it's fine i, I can still accept the fairy fairy design oh it's okay Visteria. we just um summon i literally spent a hundred wishes <laughs> I got an early PD, but it was Diluc, and then I got a Shinobu, which was nice, and then everything else was just Noel, um, like a couple Bennets, and then I finally got the, the Archon. It was a bit disappointing, I'm not gonna lie. You won your 50-50 and lost it in the same tempo, oh no! <laughs> and the weapon banner you lost, oh no, I wanted to summon on the weapon banner, but I don't have enough wishes. Wait, do, don't you know what this month is? What do you mean? Oh, okay, yeah. Mom's job is being mean? I'm only mean to fish. You know that. I'm very nice to everyone else. I promise. I try to. <laughs> Did you call one girl vaporize? Yeah, 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 because that's the name of the reaction. So, in Genshin Impact, when you react pyro on top of water or or hydro on top of pyro that's called vaporize reaction so that's like a vaporize focus i usually make my teams based on the reaction that i want except for the tomato because that's just toma and ayato together but well they are both buffing ayato's normal attack both kazuha and yunjin so that's basically like a normal attack damage and then morgana is a classic team comp that everyone knows about and it's basically just like a freeze gain you. And then physical DPS is because Eula was my first DPS, so I built a lot of my team all around her. 
And then Bloom is a new one, so it's gonna be just Bloom reactions with Nahida and Ayato and Tokomi there for healing. And Vaporize is Pyro and Hydro, so I've got Toma there to assist um, Diluc as the main DPS. And then we've got Melt, which I'm liking Lila. I want Lila as a shield for Ganyu. And I'm gonna have um, Nahida and Umber for just the burning, you know, upkeep, you know, the burning reaction all the time. And then Forest Rangers is just a cute party that I need because of the characters that I enjoy. Like, I really love Mona, I really love Kale, I really love Kaya, I really love Lisa, so I've made it a comfort them. Animal Dorime, <laughs> it's, uh, it's based on the meme, but I only call it like this because of a Hazel. And yeah, and the friendship point is just for friendship points, like I was saying. They look as best? Uh, I don't know. I don't like Diluc's personality, but I do like his gameplay style. It, it is quite fun. Maybe they destroy enemies? Probably, yeah. So let's let's um, level up Nahida. Um, I do have more constellations, I think. Oh yeah, I have a Diluc constellation. Yay! I don't even know what does that. Uh, 15 cent more damage to opponents, but uh, whatever. Wait, we have more. And then we have Shinobo. That was a pleasant surprise. When the normal charge of plunging attacks of the character affected by Shinobu, Grass Ring hits opponents, it will deal electro damage based on her HP. That's interesting. That's good. It's a, like an extra electro application. That's good. That's a good constellation. Then Bennett, I kind of want to activate it. Just for fun. I know everyone says you shouldn't do that, but like... I don't even use Bennett. Even though he's so broken, I just don't like him very much, like his gameplay. But at the same time, he's only the only pyro healer. I think it's a bit risky. When we get another pyro healer, I'll definitely activate his constellation. Although he would be good to... I don't know, I kind of want to do it. I kind of want to do it just for fun. I'll, I'll wait, I'll wait a little bit until we get like a pyro healer that is not Bennett. And then I'll activate his constellation. Oh, I have to live with this notification now. Okay. Let's see, what else do we have? So, time to test her out. That's gonna be very fun. Oh, you're gonna get another phone? Oh my god, she's so adorable, guys. Look at her. She's so cute. How does she walk? Oh my god. She is so cute. <laughs> so freaking adorable. I love her. So cute. Her animations are amazing. She's li literally a six star. That's her charged attack. I'll actually make like a big square. And then these are the normal. There's even like a sound effect. So cute. And the coolest part, when, when we go to the farm, the coolest part is that you can gather materials with her elemental skill which is insane i absolutely love that so her elemental skill is basically a camera like a photographic camera she either does like a little circle like this or you can hold and target enemies like a sniper so you kind of like snipe your enemies like this and the skill cooldown is very minimal so you don't even feel it Oh, there is nothing here. Okay, let me... Let me go somewhere that has lots of items to collect. Oh, it's a new model? That's cool! So here. Here is a good place. So you know how these plants are very annoying to get because they are really like in the edge of the mountain of the cliff or whatever how you call it. They're really annoying to get because you need to fly high and then climb and then get the plants. Now you don't need to do that anymore. You can use Nahida's elemental skill to gather everything. 
But um, now they are collected. Isn't that like amazing? I collected them from a distance. This is just insane. I love it. I love it. That's this is really cool. It's gonna be really helpful. Um, let's test her damage for now on the ball. I know she's only level 50 and she doesn't have any talent leveled up, but I just want to test it all just out of comparison to see how much damage she's gonna deal afterwards. Um, I think checking her artifacts were all leveled up. Let's see. I think they are. 20, 20, 20, 20, 20. Okay, yeah. They're all Oh, it's so good to have this catalyst because she's a little bit faster. So I need to make a reaction. Oh, crap. Ah! What? Okay, so we use the trick karma. Now we do a reaction. 5,000 already! That is okay. 5,000! <gasps> she doesn't have any level. Oh, 2,000. Okay, so 5,000 is the crit. Yeah, 2,000 again. 2,000 again. It has a little bit of an ICD. But that's okay. That's okay. Okay. 5,000 crit, 2,000 normal. That's perfectly fine. Moon? Yeah? Say it. What about Rosaria? I really like Rosaria. They look number one in boys and Rosaria number one in girls for you? Really? That's cool. Oh, let's see the pod. Or should I love her? No, let's see the Serenity pod. The Serenity pod is more important. Let's see it. Can I try to do that square move on an NPC? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. For, for reading their thoughts, right? Let's do that first. I'm really interested. I'm glad you reminded me because I completely forgot. Let's try. Let's go around and try to read. So another cool um, special thing that Mahida has. Honestly, she's like a 60 star character. She's crazy. It's, it's just crazy. So many special things. But her elemental skill, not only gather items from afar, but you can also read NPCs' minds with the elemental skill. Um, but it's not every NPC, so we will need to find an NPC that is eligible, apparently. I thought it was gonna be all of them. Not gonna lie. Oh! <laughs> That's cute. Okay, so probably the ones that are talk- like, that you can talk to, probably. Let's test it. Makri. We can really read everyone's minds. This is so much fun. Oh my god, I want to read every NPC's brain. That's my new, you know, Nahida Maze. <laughs> Kusanali Maze purpose is reading everyone's minds. Oh, poor grandpa. Okay, so these guys probably don't work because you can't talk to them. Okay, let's find more talk uh, like characters that I can talk to. Oh my god, horrible wings. Let me change that. Oh, wings will look good on her. Yeah, I'll keep the owl. Okay. That's so cool. That is so cool. I want to do that all day. <laughs> oh my gosh, she's so tiny. You can also see their mood. You see? Let's... <laughs> so relatable. Oh, she's a nice person. Let's read the child's. Oh. <laughs> That's cute. Let's 
breed McDonald's. Okay, don't like him. This is a nice person. You're nicer. Okay, that is so cool, guys. I'm probably gonna... I'm probably gonna try to read everyone's... Is it just on Sumero City? Or, like, literally, if we go to, like... Like, Port Ormos. Let's go there. Let's see. Someone we can talk to. <gasps> We can really read everyone's minds in the whole country. Let, let me see, like, the whole nation or whatever. Um, let me see someone who's, like, kind of, like, not in the city. Like, for this guy. Guy? D.I.? I I do not know how to say it. Here. Oh my god. God, we can literally read everyone's minds. Let's go to Caravan Riva. I want to see in the desert if it works. Because they don't have Akasha terminals in the desert, so it would make sense to not be able to read them. Let's see, Marcia. What? Okay, our own village. Let's see. Although we may have we may trigger the, the, the story quest by accident, but. Let's try to find here. Hello. Wait, but they don't have Akasha terminals. Does that mean it works like outside of Sumeru? Let me go to Liyue. I would be so shocked if it did. That would be insane. Yeah, I'm gonna try in other places. I imagine it's only on Sumeru, but let's let's try here in Liyue. Let's see, like, um, I can NC. Nah, uh, yeah, it doesn't work outside Sumeru, I think. Let me just go to Monstad just, just to make sure. And we don't go to Inazuma because nobody talks about Inazuma in this channel. We don't like Inazuma. We're not, we're not going there. Ever again. I'm never stepping on Inazuma ever again. Oh yeah, I think it's only Sumeru, but still, that's already so impressive. It's such a cool feature, like something so unique. That's really cool. Oh, it's a shame. I wanted to, to read Timmy's Timmy's mind. <laughs> you know the 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 pigeon kid. I'm ashamed. Um, I'm ashamed. No, it's a shame that she doesn't have a special sprint as well. I wish I wish she had waves, Timmy. What? Oh, Timmy, there you are. Oh, but I can collect the stuff. <laughs> Does it work with like interactable items as well? Like you know, like things that you need to apply elements together. That would be brilliant. Let me see what we did here. Nah, it doesn't. Okay, it's fine. It's already useful. It's already really good. Oh, does it work in fish? Let's see if it works in fish. You should try on Katarine. Oh, I'll try on Katarine. Uh, let me just try to get the fish. You understand? Yes. Nah, it doesn't work either. It's fine. Okay, so you can't get like living creatures, just gatherable items. And you can read everyone's thoughts that are inside Sumeru, including the desert. Oh, shit. I, I hit my mic. Oh, I'm sorry. Um, let's try to read Katarine. Katarine? Katarine. Does she have any thoughts, though? Because she's a bot. Like, she's a... She's an android. I don't think she's gonna have any thoughts. Maybe just, like, 0101. Oh, she doesn't. I knew it. I felt like she wouldn't. That makes sense. Oh, I haven't done my commissions yet. Oh, we need to do my commissions. Let's check the Serenity pot because I'm really excited about Serenity pot. I cannot wait because the Inazuma pot is really beautiful, 
but I've reached my limit, you know? I've already reached the limit of my creativity here. Oh, by the way, now, I don't know if you guys know, but now we have the replica um, feature on the teapot, which means I can export all my creations and I can create an, a code and you can copy that code and import your creation to your teapot. So I'm gonna definitely be sharing all my, you know, groups um, with you guys if you want. Like, I'll probably separate into sections, like pool area and then shrine probably area. It's gonna be like this small set here. And then I can probably do one for the house of this little garden. And maybe I can do like this shrine as well, this temple. And everything else that I built. So yeah, I'll, I'll definitely export all of that later, the codes. I left off. Something new. Oh, this is the replica. So, yeah, so you can like either add from someone else or you can like generate a replica of all of this arrangement and everyone else can have that in their pots, which is really cool because now people can share their creations. It's amazing. I wish Animal Crossing New Horizons had that because <laughs> that's really cool. Oh, she's, she's doing her animation. Oh, she stays for a long time. Oh. This is so adorable. Does she stay until like a walk, maybe? That would be amazing. It never ends! I think it only ends if you start walking. That's brilliant! That's the best idol animation. Oh my god, so adorable! She's so cute. Yeah, I think it I think it doesn't stop until you walk. That's cool. I didn't know that. Let me drink some water. Hydrate guys. It's only Genshin today, yeah, and very short live stream as well because I I still work tomorrow. I did try to get some time off, but I didn't accept for some reason. It's been... Some things have been changing there. And it's it, it's not flexible as it was before. So I haven't been able... Because like up until today, I've been working in the same business for three years. And every time there was an update, I, I was... Or like a sponsored video or something, I could always cover. Like naturally, like I could just say, oh, I'm gonna be off like tomorrow and I'll cover this. And no, because it, it's work. <laughs> I'm making money anyways. Um, but now it's not really like that anymore. It's not flexible anymore. So I can't do that anymore. Which is really, really, really sad. And yeah, it's, it's kind of complicated. So unfortunately, I have to work tomorrow. So I won't, I won't be streaming for long today, unfortunately. What, what was I going to do? Buy the new pot. Yeah, let's get the new pot. So in case you don't know, you need to complete the first two story quests to be able to buy the pot, which doesn't make any sense, but it's what they chose to do. Where is it? Here. Oh, nice. Finally! And we also have some very interesting furniture. Let's buy the sets first, because I want to see everyone's sets. If I do have money left, I'll buy the rest of this. I'll probably have money, though, because I've been saving for a while. Because I knew that the pot update was going to come over because I saw links and stuff. So I was like, okay, I'm going to start saving some of my money. Hopefully it will be enough. I'll first buy the things that I think is prettier. Like this. This is amazing. This is absolutely amazing. I really need a phone thing. Two phone things, even better. More lamps, more lamps. Okay. And then, uh, I don't care about that. I don't care about buildings right now. Because first I want to do my house. Oh, that's nice. Oh, that's cool. Wow. Oh my god, these are really pretty. I'm shocked. Oh, this looks amazing. It's like a kebab. I can have my own kebab at home now. Finally. Okay, I can have a little oven. Oh, amazing. We can have like all this stuff that Kalei and Tanari have. 
like bookcases and plants and things. Not my money. My money is not gonna be enough. Um, I'm, I, I'll prioritize indoors because I like to decorate indoors first. Because for exterior, like, I take a long time to decorate, you know, it doesn't come naturally to me. Indoors is a lot easier for me, personally. You can have the incense <laughs> go crazy, get high. Okay, I think we're almost done with the interior design stuff. Oh, there are stairs. There are stairs. Can we do bridges? Maybe? Oh my god, I'll need so much wood. I don't have enough wood, I think. That'll be a problem. Mansion Pagoda. Flower of Revelation. What that is? I don't even understand what this is. It's like a little tree. Courtyard, courtyard. Oh no, my money. Um... Okay, let's see what's the price. Oh, oh this is good. Wire. Can I have that? Yes, ma'am. Pottery. Pottery of sin of wisdom. I like pottery. Excuse me. Okay, I'll buy the pottery. I quite like feasting, but I don't really know what that is. But I'll buy anyways. And we've got a Damasi, we've got aromas. These are just shops from the Sumeru city, right? Oh, maybe I will be able to buy everything. Um, almost everything. Oh my god, amazing! Okay. Okay! We- Oh my god, I saved exactly the amount that I needed. <laughs> what are the chances? That's crazy! What? That's amazing, and I even bought the resin. Okay, perfect. Let's just start creating some furnishings. I really want to see that. Oh, I need to learn the recipes first. Okay, learn, learn, learn. The job is mean. Oh my god, yes, it's been. It's been really mean. Ah, uh, yeah. So many complaints. Oh, I'm not gonna. I'm, I don't want to think about work right now. <laughs> Whatever. Um. Okay, just rocks. More rocks. Um. Oh, more rocks is good. It's also the good sign of having Yoimiya is that I can get some of my rocks back. I'm not gonna complain about that, even though I didn't want Yoimiya in this account, but that's okay. It happens. Oh, everything needs rocks for some reason. I'll just build as many as possible and then we will move on to this the actual pot and just explore the pot and start decorating it a little bit and see all the new items. So I'll try to build as many items as I can. I don't know if I have enough wood or materials, but I'll try to build as many as I can. I really want that. I really want that. I really want the kebab. I really want hungry. And then I want this. this. Maybe I'll need to buy some of those as well. I'll be super fast because I don't want to waste our time with this, okay? More bookcases. More bookcases. A cute bed. I was excited about this because we don't get many beds and all the beds currently are so ugly. Lena's in my bed is like alright, but like most beds are just so ugly. This is very cute. Okay, now we're starting to, to use the wood. Rock, that's good. I don't care about spending rocks because rocks are, there are so many. Oh crap, I pressed the wrong button. I'm going, I'm going super, super speedy. <laughs> Nice, we have a lot that can be crafted by Yoimiya. And a lot they only use like fabric and rock as well, that's very good. I think I'll be able to create all of them, because I have quite a lot of woods. I didn't even know I had so many. I've been converting every week, 
using the rocks to create more woods. Although they are only using the same type of woods. Which wood is this? Karma Fala. Okay. Oh, this uses a uh, clay to one. Okay. I'm getting hungry too because I haven't had dinner. And I didn't have breakfast either. I literally just had lunch today. <laughs> it was such a rush day. Who got Nahida? Hi Kakashi! Well, welcome! How are you doing? I got Nahida finally, after a hundred wishes. I've got one Ziluk, one Shinobu, many Noels, and Nahida. That's basically what happened with the summons. Um, I was quite unlucky, I think. Well, I was lucky because at least I got one early PD, which was Ziluk. But I would have appreciated if the early feed was Nahida instead, and then I would have guaranteed Scaramouche. That would be perfect in my book, but it's okay. I'm not gonna complain. At least I got Nahida. It's fine. I'm now crafting all the furniture that I can, and I just bought the Serenity Paw, but I didn't explore it yet. I didn't open up yet, so that's the next thing. That's the desert furniture. I think I've already built all the others. Yeah, I did. Okay, I'm almost finishing the furniture. I think I will be able to craft everything. That's crazy. I was very well prepared. I'm really surprised with myself. Because usually I don't prepare well. Especially this month where I haven't played games too much because I didn't have time. So I thought I wouldn't be able to do anything today in the live stream. But how are you doing, Kakashi? How's things? Okay, almost finishing. Is it just two more? Really? They built everything? That was so fast. What? I really built everything. That was very efficient. Okay. Let's go ahead and switch the realm style. Oh my god. I'm very excited. Oh, you've got your account team now. That's amazing. I don't have the Shogun yet, so I can't do a full Oracle team. I really want her, but every time she comes back, it's in the worst timing. So. Oh, wait. Obtain the. I, I have the tree, the fruit, though. Do I need to interact from my bag? That's very complicated. All the, all the sets. All the sets. Use. Okay. Oh, it doesn't work now. And we also have a blue wish. Let's do that. Ah, just garbage. Okay, let's switch the realm style. Nice. I'm very excited. I think it's gonna be so cute. You wish. Uh, yes. Sublime spice wood. Yeah, I really want Shogun so I can have my Archon team. <gasps> oh my god, it's beautiful. Look at the size of the leaves. Where am I though? Oh, this is a house. Oh my god, it's it's like a tree house. Oh my god, it's so adorable. No way they did a tree house with Sumero. That's amazing. Look at the giant, like, trunks of tree or whatever that is. Going to the sky, you don't even see where they're going. What? Not the giant flowers blooming? Oh my god, there's so much detail! The flowers just bloomed. So I guess they bloom during the day and and they like unbloom during the night, or is it just because it's the first time we are here? Let's let's check it out. Oh yeah! Oh my god! <laughs> That's insane! Okay. 
okay, that's like a five star layout for the, t the teapot. So during the night, the flowers will close. That's amazing. And that's so pretty. What the fuck? What the fuck is going on here? Okay, let's explore, but I'll, I'll put on the daylight just so we can see better. This is insane. <laughs> this is insane. I'm so excited because I love the serene teapot. Wait, why did they bloom? Or is it like at 6 a.m. maybe? Oh, it's around at 6 a.m. Maybe they have a time? Oh, that looks amazing. Look at the giant trees on the background. Like, these, like, it's full of, like, clouds and giant trees and giant plants. It feels like we are in a dream. Oh, now they're blooming. So they bloom around six, half past six. That's when they start blooming. That's amazing. Okay, let's explore. So the, the house is a, is a tree house. That's actually incredible. Let's go down there this is stairs here and some leaves oh it's adorable oh my god what this is the most beautiful pot ever i don't even know what to say can they get to the giant trees no i don't think so they're too far away What's the map? I've seen the map before. Okay. So we have, it's like four lotuses almost. Wait, that's not a path? I thought that was a path. Where is the path? Oh, we are on the giant leaf. Where is the leaf? Oh, here is the leaf. The giant leaf, okay. Let's go to the path. Oh my god, the entrance with the flowers. This is so cool. This is so cool. Look at the flowers. Oh my god. This is beautiful. I feel I feel like I'm I'm in like a fairy game now. Because I'm using a fairy. This is so huge. It feels like it's bigger than the other pots. Doesn't it? How do you unlock a new realm? So, if you finish the Archon Quest from the previous update, you just need to talk to Tubby. And then on the fourth option of the shop, um, when you click Shop Realm, there will be a pink fruit that you can buy. That pink fruit, you buy it, you open your bag, and you use the fruit. That's how you unlock the realm. That is incredible. It costs a thousand realm currency. Which is cheap. That's fine. Oh wait, here's the path. <gasps> what? What? Did you see that? The, the, the vines just like grew around me. What is going on? This spot is amazing. What the hell? There's so many details, like little Look at the vines! What? What's going on? So as you approach, the vines just start moving. That's cool. Oh, the path is so pretty. I wish I could build on the path as well. Here we have like more giant leaves and flowers, like up close. And then here we have another path. she walks it makes music what when the heat is springs there is a music that's crazy so many crazy additions i i don't i don't know what to think right now there are too many details the design is amazing playovers did outdid themselves this time I'm, I'm pleased. I'm pleased with the result. 
They really love Silverall. We have another poem here. This poem is also adorable. Holy crap. And that's where the house is. Back in the background. Oh. It's when she walks. It makes the music. I don't know if you guys can hear it because of the background music that I left. But. By the way, isn't that like a little bit conflicting? Let me remove my playlist. And I'll increase the audio from the desktop like really high right now. Let's see if you guys can hear. See? It makes like a like a musical note, like a like a piano note. Like bling, bling, bling. Am I crazy? That's crazy. What? Anyways, let me decrease the volume again. And let's check the house, because I forgot to check the house from the inside. Oh, right behind me there are like a bunch of flowers. Can we climb these? Because they look like they're like off. Off the area. But at the same time I feel like we can we can actually reach them. Let's try. Maybe I will die and lose all my old mates. <laughs> it's okay. This place is so cool. I'm just absolutely in shock. Oh, I think I need a Kazuha here. No, I'll probably die if I go there. I'll try it though. I'll try later. Um, Let's check the house. I'm curious to see the house inside. Because one thing that I really like about Inazuma House is that the doors are sliding doors. And I really like that because they open in a really cool way. So I hope they cap the sliding doors. Although it's it's kind of like a Japanese thing, isn't it? Um, Let's go. The door looks nice. Even in her normal attack sequence, she doesn't know. Yeah, she does. But this one is more obvious, I think. She's very musical, like a musical character. It's interesting because the Aranara has all the ha um the music and stuff. Um, the house looks really open. It's kind of like a really open plan. It also looks a lot bigger than the others, but it may be an illusion just because of how open it is. So uh, let me see. We have door, door, door. We have three doors downstairs. Oh, it's not a sliding door. I'm sad. Oh. I want the sliding doors. <laughs> but it's fine. The house is amazing. I love the wood colors. And upstairs we have two doors. Okay. It's nice I have a nice view of the downstairs. That all looks good. Let's decorate a little bit with what we've built. Let me drink some water again. Oh, that's a roof. Okay. If I put in a Zuma doors, do they open sliding or do they open like a normal door? They look awful though. Oh no, they open like a normal door. Okay, okay, okay. Let's put back. What? Uh, that's not what I want. No. Let me add in my pot. What? Oh, okay. Um, nice. So let's see everything new that we have or everything that is from Sumero. That's big. That's a big shelving unit. I don't like that in the living room. That's cute. Also feel like it's a kitchen thing. That also feels like a kitchen thing. And then we have the bookcases. Ooh, the bookcases look pretty. Oh, I like it is. Also, the floor is agreed, which helps you decorate. Oh my god, the bookcases look amazing. Let me stack them here. Maybe like this. section the space a little bit since the space is so big
Because we can have a pottery area there. What's this? A uh, place to put our, all of our pottery stuff. And we have a table that looks perfect for reading. We have a big table as well, but I feel like this is more like a dinner table. What? Oh, you can have your actual kebab shop. <laughs> I'll make like a pottery pottery shop though, instead of a kebab. Let me put a bed here. That looks so adorable. I love this bed so much. This is so much better than every other bed in this game. Also, let's make the kitchen. I'll put the table here. And I'll put those those big shelves here. I just I'm just not a fan of the windows because the windows don't let much light in. So it feels a little bit like dark inside, a little claustrophobic, I would say. But because the wood is really light and the space is really open, I think it's fine. I like this. The wood the wood color is amazing. I love the wood color. That's the wood color that I put in my house. <laughs> um let me put like benches there. I'll just leave uh, things however, just so we can see the items themselves. The chair looks amazing. Look at the detail. Like not just the drawing here, but like how they are kind of like old and used. I find it amazing that they put this kind of like texture on the painting, you know? Crazy. Really good. Okay, let me put a little bench there for the pottery. And let's see what else we have here. Oh, we have many vases. They are perfect for the pottery place. Oh, I can't put on top though. That's so huge. That's massive. The green one is pretty. I don't like the music one, so I'll, I'll kind of like hide it here. Can we put on top? <gasps> we can put on top! Amazing! That's great. Okay, that's gonna look a lot better. Like a proper shop, you know? Oh, that's so adorable! We're gonna have a little, like a little pot, pottery shop inside. That's so cute. I don't know what to do with this. I really don't like that music vase. What? The incense is huge? It's not an incense. It's like a lab for the plants, I think. Interesting. Very interesting. Very weird thing. I'll pretend that's like an oven for the pottery, okay? What's that? That looks like a bag. That is so cool. The items are so pretty. I don't know what to say. They're so beautiful. Look at the design of this. I want this bag for me. That's amazing. That's so pretty. You can maybe have like some books thrown around as well in the floor. And for the, the stuff for kebab in the kitchen. Have a little oven here. Then we have the kebab place. I'll put, I'll put it here. Oh no no no! I'm gonna. I love that they now allow you to clip items. Like this is so good. I'm so happy we can clip the items now. It made all difference, you know. Like this looks so much better now that I can clip it. Mm, let me see what else. Oh, rugs. We have many rugs. We can use all the rugs everywhere. I wish I could at least overlap the rugs, but we can't. They they have like a little glitch that doesn't allow you to, to clip them up. 
Well, that's good. We can do like a full rug floor. The green, the green is very, I don't know, very eye catching. Sorry, I couldn't stay for long. I missed the streams, but I gotta go. That's totally fine. Don't worry. This stream is gonna end in a bit, anyways, because I can't, I can't stream for long today. So I'm probably gonna be leaving a bit. It's okay. Thank you so much for showing up, though. Even though it's like middle of the week, you know. I hope you're alright, Kakashi. It's been a long time. Okay, I'll leave it like this for now. I wish I could put them closer to each other, but it doesn't work very well with the bug that's going on. There we go, lots of rugs. And now we have the pretty lamp. I think the pretty lamp looks nice here. And then we also have lots of things here there as well. There's so much. There's so many items. How did I manage to build everything? What? This is perfect for the pottery area. <gasps> Ooh, fancy. Let's put the rest in the kitchen. We have now a dinner table. That they all look amazing. They all look incredible. Like look at the peaches. We put everything in, then we look a little bit more close up. Oh my god, look at the amount of detail. Like even the plates. These are things that you can't even notice, you know, if you don't stop to look at it. That's insane. That is so cool. They they put so much attention to detail to everything related to Sumeru. It's insane. I'll put some like good something here. Oh, maybe not. Okay. There you go. I'm gonna save just in case. But like another rug here. And then wall decor we have just free. I think that looks better in the bedroom, right? So I'll put in the bedroom. Like on top of the bed like this. Oh, that's cute. And then we have a shield. I have no idea. Ah, I guess this is like a desert item. And then decoration. We have the lamp that we already have. And then indoors, we have the new sets. So let's see all the sets and everything. And everyone that needs them for friendship points. Oh, here. Here they are. Oh, there are many. Okay. Um, We have some for... Tainarian Kali, we have for Dorian Nilo. We have um, for no one, at least for now. Maybe it's for like newer characters like Scaramouche and Farazan and Al Haytham and you know, Gia and all the characters that are gonna come up. Oh, Sino, I don't have Sino, so. Um, Lila and Nahida. Oh, it's the. What's this? This looks like a hospital. I don't like this. And then one for Candace. Okay, so we have friendship sets for everybody now. That's very good. Let's see the outdoor sets. Oh my god, the furniture. I love the furniture so much. This bag is amazing. The lamp is amazing. I really like those. And of course the hugs are amazing because of the sound. But I also love the idea of having your own pottery. The way she sits, she needs to climb the chair to see. That's so cute. Look at her climbing. Look. 
Oh my god. That's so adorable. Okay. Let's go outside and see the outdoor furniture. The furniture looks incredible. Oh, actually, we didn't check the chick the chicken or the kitchen and the bedroom. Hold up. Let's go. So here's the kitchen stuff. We have the kebab. I'm so hungry. We have more like skewers. We have a uh, cooking equipment there, and I love these things on the table. The peaches and all of this pottery set. And then on the bedroom, we have the cute beds. Wait, why is the bed? Oh, it's not here. So here's the bed. The bed looks amazing. And that thing on the wall also looks incredible. With the plants and such. Okay, let's see the outdoor furniture. And the sets as well for the friendship points. Oh, it's night time. Okay, for outside we have all oh, the beautiful fountains. Mm, I'm excited to see those up close. Let me put the fountain here. And then the desert thing doesn't matter right now. Let's see. Oh, we have lots of stuff. Oh, oh, wait, what? This is massive. I thought that was a, like a plant, like a potted plant or something. What? You can do your own tree house city, basically. Tree house village. What? That is huge. What the hell? What? That is insane. The items are massive. What? You can literally do your own tree. Oh, can you maybe connect those with the stairs? Maybe that's what they are made for. <gasps> that would be amazing. That would be so amazing. What? Wait, I'll have to put someone in the next round. Okay, that's pretty. These are all the Sumeru City kind of style. Let's put everything and we'll see them up close with Nahida. Oh, that's a massive tower. Okay. I think it's the lighthouse. Oh my god, everything's massive. That's why the pot is so big. Because all the furniture items are huge. Oh my god. <laughs> They're too big. They don't fit in. Um, Let's see what else do we have here. Let me put a TP. Just to make it easier to access all of those later. And let's go back to building. And we have more buildings. We have these, we have these, and these. I'm just placing everything so we can have a, a closer look. This is amazing. What? What? What even is this? This is so gorgeous. What the hell? <laughs> That's so pretty. Okay, land form. We have some new plants and things that I bought. Um, I'll just place the prettiest one. I'm not gonna place everything because uh, plants is just plants, right? We don't need to see all of them up close. I think I'll put like a tree. Oh, the tree is massive as well. Okay, <laughs> forget about that. Um, let me see what else do we have here. This looks cute. This looks cute. Oh my god, I need to buy so many of those. And these as well. And this one as well. Oh yeah, let me test the stairs. I feel like you can connect. <gasps> Switch vertical. Oh my god, this is amazing. Look, look what you can do. You can now make stairs between... Like, you can make suspended bridges and suspended stairs to connect higher levels of things like you can connect this tree house places you can connect like a like a building to another you can connect like the roof to the floor you can now climb the roof with like your own customized high up stairs this is crazy oh my god i didn't know they were gonna add so many cool stuff to the pot i'm missing out here wait Okay, yeah, I think that's it, right? 
So now I put these stairs here. Oh my god, this is amazing. You can build loads of these and connect all these scenes. I am shook. I have no words. This is just too great. This is just too great. What? You can make your suspended bridges and stairs. Let's see, do we have anything new here? Nope. We do have some plants. I'm just gonna, again, I'm just gonna drop everything here, guys, and we'll we'll have a look with Nahida. Just that I don't actually know everything that is new, so I have to double check one by one. This is not interesting. Oh, the lamps are nice. Oh, <gasps> so big. Everything is big. I just don't get it. Why everything's so huge? Oh my god, that's even bigger. Okay. Oh, we have animals? New animals? No, 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 that's just stuff that I cached. Okay, beauty. And then the outdoor sets, let's have a look. We have quite a few as well. So we have one for Dory. We have one for Kali and Sino. We have this beautiful fountain for Milo. We have this one, which doesn't have a person yet, but will probably be one of the new characters. Then we have Candace and Lila. And then we have another one without people. And then one for Nahida, which is the fountain. And another fountain for Tainari. That's cool. Oh my god, Mikhail! How are you? It's been so long. How are you doing? I'm Unfortunately, I'm almost finishing the stream, though. I'm so sorry. It's just like an off-schedule stream. I, I did I did ping on Discord, I think, though. Did you not get it? Maybe, maybe there's a problem with Discord? Or maybe I didn't ping? I don't know. Maybe I did something wrong there. I'll, I'll double-check later. Let me put today time. So basically, I just unlocked the serenity pot and everything is amazing. <laughs> That's it. Like, look at this. Look at the flowers. They're gonna bloom. Where are the flowers? Look at them blooming. They're closed during the night, and when you hit like half past six a.m., they start blooming and opening up until they become like full bloomed flowers. It's amazing. <laughs> To take pictures and decorate and just be here. It's just gonna be so cool. That's incredible. Okay, let's see all the items. I still haven't seen her old mate either. I need to see that. So here are the lamps. The lamps are massive. The plants are massive. <gasps> it's it's like a lavender. I love it. That's so cute. I love lavender, it's one of my favorite favorite flowers okay these ones are very very adorable these two are literally the same plant but okay and then this fountain is pretty but this fountain is so much better i love this fountain here i'm gonna use loads of these this is amazing okay and let's try to climb up again and just see everything from above everything's just huge everything's just massive where are the stairs? It's so cute. Oh my god. She's so pretty. Every, every time she jumps and runs, it makes music. I love it. Okay, so we have a big tree there. Some other big chunky trees there as well. We have this courtyard that is like kind of like higher up. This is definitely like Gandharva Vio style. And this is the stairs that I created. That's so cool. This courtyard is also so beautiful. What is this? I don't even know what I, this is. Can we climb? Oh, we can climb. Okay. Let's see what's here. Oh, it's another floor. Oh my god. You see what I mean? Like you can make stairs from this floor to down there or to like another floor. That's amazing. Oh, this is the perfect place to take a picture. L let me let me see if she gets her idle animation. And we'll take a picture. Now I'm sure I just didn't look at my notification. Oh, maybe that. Yeah, <laughs> if you didn't, probably that's it. <laughs> it's an off-schedule stream. I wanted to stream earlier, but it's just because of the update, basically. There is a summer 
theme teapot now. Yeah, cottage car fans going crazy. <laughs> I am a cottage car um, fan, so I'm pretty. I'm going crazy, as you can see. I can't even speak. <laughs> I'm just shook. Like, everything is just amazing. Nahida is beautiful. She's like a six star character. She has incredible animations for everything that she does. Like, what the fuck is this? Her eye animation doesn't go away until you walk. All her animations have music, special effects, um, normal attack, charge attack, elemental skill, all amazing. She's super cracked, super strong, easy to build. She's just beautiful. And then the Serenity pod is just amazing. The furniture is so pretty, honestly. You can make a hidden tea table there. Yeah, I was thinking something like that as well, like a, a hidden tea with flowers and things, like like really fantasy magical kind of thing. That's actually a great idea, Miguel. I'm gonna steal that. I'm gonna do that. And one of the good things about the pot is that when you build something now, you can share with your friends. So like, if I build all of these, I can come here and I create a code and I can send this code to everyone and everyone can have the same furniture set in their house. I think that's so cool. Oh, she's so pretty. Like, look at her animations. What the fuck? I just don't get it. How how can it be so good? Ah, oh, this is so cute. Let me see if I can grab her face. Oh, I did it the wrong way. <laughs> That's cute. <laughs> That's such a cute photo. I am just in shock. Absolutely in shock. I have no words for this spot. This spot is amazing. The furniture is amazing. Nahid is amazing. Everything is amazing. 10 out of 10. Whoeverse all did themselves. Now we have the big courtyard. I'm guessing that I also have like two floors. And then we have the place for Nilo to dance. That's so cute. And we have lots of buildings. We have the cafe. We have kind of like a library looking style. And then we have kind of like a kebab shop. A pottery shop. Also amazing. And then we have Gondorvaville. Well, actually, this is more like a Vimara vi village, right? Kind of houses, I think. Also very cute. Very pretty. Everything's very pretty. That's crazy. And even the pot has like special animations. I think this is the floor. Like, look at this. I don't know if you could see it. Let me t let me TP again. So when you're getting closer to the paths, the vines start moving. But like, it's easier for me to notice because of the sound. Let me see if it's going to show up now. No, I think I need to TP away. Let me TP away, and then I'll TP back on. Where is the path? Here. No, there. I'm lost. Why am I so bad with directions? Why is it not happening anymore? Oh, just because I talked about it. Let's see if any of the vines are gonna grow again. Maybe because it grew all once this day, so I'm gonna grow again. Please, I'm not crazy. Oh, look at the vines! Oh, here! There we go. It's when you get closer all away from them. That's crazy. It's so much detail. Like, why would they even do that? That's just so cool. That feels amazing. And the sound effect's really nice as well. They made a good job in making her look like a fake creature, if that wasn't the intent. Yeah, she does look like a fairy a lot. Um, even more with, like, traditional fey, um, kind of like the, the old folk tales that we have. Like, especially around here, like, Ireland, Wales, Scotland, all these places, they have, like, their own fey, like, fey... Tales and mythology, almost like a mythology, right? And she definitely does look like that because she has like the little elf ears that fairies, fae usually have. And she's tiny as well. So she's perfect. She's really cute. I think that's great. I didn't see if her, if her hair shines when she uses elemental skill. 
Oh, he does. Okay. Let's see her ultimate now. That's the only thing that we missed today. We still haven't done. Uh, let's try to do like um. Get like her some particles and ult use her ult. She's really weak right now because I didn't level her up, but she's already dealing like five thousand damage, which is insane. Because she doesn't have any talent leveled up and she's not leveled up herself. I also like the details, like she has a little bell on her back and just like this heart um, icon looks just like Kingdom Hearts. I really like it. It's very nice. It's just perfect. Everything about the Paw and Sumeru and Nahida and everything. It's just amazing. I'm very excited to do the story quest as well because we stopped the story quest in a very critical moment there. And we're gonna fight against Karamush, which is gonna be awesome. Let's see her in action. Okay. Let's go. Oh my god, this is so pleasing. It is so satisfying to use her elemental skill, I swear. Like, only having her to know the feeling. It's just so incredible. The feeling is really, really great. Like, it, it, you feel like you're hitting your targets like a sniper, and it's so fun. I swear. Okay, let's defeat the target with her old mate now. I was saying about this, like, earlier on the stream, but, like, I would have preferred her if she was an adult, but because I feel like they wanted to do a fairy, I'm happy with her design. I don't have anything to complain about. And the music when she walks. <laughs> That's such a nice detail. The R and R references as well. Okay, so apparently her ultimate just is just a buff for her elemental skill. So it's not gonna deal any damage, but it's gonna make our elemental skill deal more damage. Let's go. Oh, that's so pretty. Let's see. Oh no, I didn't crit. No. I'm not critting! Why am I not critting? Oh, the ultimate is really quick. Crap, I didn't crit during the ults. No. <laughs> we couldn't see the full potential. Oh, wait. Ah, interesting. Look. So, I'm not applying pyro anymore, but the burning continues. She maintains the burning on the enemy. That's very useful. That is really good for Ganyo. That is gonna act exactly how I want it. Oh shit, I killed her by accident. <laughs> I was touching my face. No. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh my god. Okay, I need to test something. So, I was hoping she would be great for Melt Ganyu. But she's gonna be even better. Because her elemental skill lasts for like 20 seconds or more. And having her with Ganyu and a Pyro Applicator means that you're gonna have... Because we were not using Shangling. So, she kept... Right? Like, we were not using Shangling, and we only used the Tree Karma elemental skill, and sh and the enemy kept burning. So, she maintains the burning effect just by applying her elemental skill, which makes Ganyu melt a lot easier, because then the enemy is always burning, so Ganyu is always gonna melt. I think that's it. Let's test it out. I don't know if you guys are following what I mean. I'm just going nerdy now. <laughs> I'm sorry. I was already planning to use her like this, but I wasn't sure it was gonna work so well. If it really is true what I'm saying, it means she's gonna work amazing. Like, proper amazing. 
let's test it out. But I need the Sparrow Beast because the enemy is gonna die instantly with my Ganyo because now I have Ganyo Constellation. Uh, sorry for being indelicate, but you sound a little sleepy. Oh, I am sleepy. <laughs> You're not being delicate at all. Don't worry about it. I am very sleepy. I'm not necessarily sleepy actually, but I'm very tired. Very, very tired <laughs> with everything. <laughs> Emotionally, physically. I also have hurt myself a lot yesterday because I was building new furniture. Because I bought a lot of new furniture, like the shelf behind me is new. And lots of other things as well that I've been updating my house and my setup. Um, and I was building all this furniture and the furniture is just really heavy and I'm, I'm not very strong. I, I'm just like really proper weak. And then especially with the wardrobe, because I bought a wardrobe and it was so heavy. I actually, when I was dragging stuff downstairs in my stairs, I cut myself completely. <laughs> I cut my leg and I cut my hands as well. It's really bad. I don't know if I'm gonna, I don't know if it's gonna be visible, but it literally like a, a piece of wood just got like stabbed my hand. I thought it was gonna come across honestly because it was so deep. It's really hurting really bad. But yeah, I, so I'm physically tired for building furniture for the past few days and I'm also emotionally tired of life for the past like I don't know 28 years <laughs> basically um but it will be it will be okay it will be fine <laughs> eventually um but it's fine um and don't worry it's not indelicate at all I am really tired I'm I'm actually sorry um for looking tired I didn't want to look tired I'm really trying my best to keep up my energy level but yeah, I'm I'm just too transparent, I guess. I'm sorry guys. I don't I don't wanna feel like I'm killing the mood, you know. You build all of this in a single day? No 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 uh, almost three days building stuff. <laughs> so the wardrobe I built two days ago or three days ago. I don't even know. Yeah, it was basically over three days. So I built like the wardrobe, I built a shelving unit, I built a little bench uh, not bench, like a stool that I bought as well. What else did I buy? Oh, I bought I built a table for my brother because he's gonna start living with me by the end of the year. So I made a little desk setup for him and also a wardrobe for my brother. <laughs> so it was a lot of stuff. <laughs> lots of lots and lots of furniture. But it's it's great. I'm excited because my house, I was using old furniture from the previous owner all year. And I was just saving money until I could buy like some new cool furniture. Furniture here is really cheap, but I'm just being a little bit broke, you know, lately. So I couldn't buy earlier. But I'm very excited that I managed to finally update my setup. Especially, like, the shelving unit. It looks so cute. And I have my little Totoro. I don't know if you can see it. But I have my Totoro there and my Gigi. I'm gonna I'm gonna record all of that and put in the vlog later. Um, I just didn't do that yet because I'm lazy. But I have to do it. So let's see. Let's test it out while I was saying... We need strong enemies. Mm, they don't work because they have a shield. Uh, let me see who's the first here. Okay, perfect. Let's test. So, gain you. Where is Mahida? Here. The Sonali. John Lee will be a good. And someone to apply Pyro. And then here it doesn't matter because we just want to test it. Totoro is always visible, is it? Oh, that's nice. I'm not good at building furniture, by the way. <laughs> I don't know if I've ever mentioned that, but every time I build furniture, something goes wrong. This time I managed to build the furniture all right, but then I I went wrong, <laughs> you know what I mean? But last time that I was building, my shelving unit was upside down and my cabinet has a door that just doesn't close. <laughs> That's, it beats the purpose of having a cabinet, not having the door to close, but it was the best that I can do. I'm just so bad with it. It's it's frustrating. Anyways, okay, let's try. Let's gather everything on the center. Let's use the old mate. Use the old mate. Elemental skill. Whee! Okay, eternal burning now, right? Oh my god, it is true! Mel's Ganyu has never been more powerful. I can't fix this. Oh my god, this is incredible. I don't know, I didn't really need Ganyu to be stronger, but I'm not gonna complain that she is, you know? 
Okay. That's insane, guys. That's insane. She's so strong now. What? So we keep the burning forever. The problem is that the enemies are dying too fast. <laughs> they can't keep up. <laughs> they just die instantly. Oh my god, so we can have eternal mouth now with Genio. That's crazy. That's a crazy strong team. I'm gonna put Lila here as a shield and it's gonna be a very cute team. But for now, I'm gonna be using my friendship team and my main here. Oh yeah, let me replace Kale. It hurts me because I love Kale, but unfortunately the Archon is just superior. I'm gonna put Candace back because she has high friendship. Okay. That's that's nice. Let's try the bloom comp just for fun as well. Let's see the effects. Cause I know she works really well with quick and, and burning, but let's try it with a bloom comp. So Ayato, Nakida, and then maybe Kokomi just to prevent us from dying. Wait until you find you built it inside out. <laughs> Maybe. Um, I can't say anything because maybe that, that is a possibility. Okay, yeah. Nothing to complain about. It's extremely strong anyways. 9,000, that's so much. I am so shocked. Wow, I just, I don't even know what to say. She's so powerful. She's literally cracked. She is correct. Sumeru is the best region. Sumeru pot is the best pot. Sumeru Archon is the best Archon. And that's it for today. <laughs> that's the summary for today's stream. I think I'm gonna end the stream now because I'm really, really hungry. It's half past eight and I haven't eaten. Um, so I'm gonna have dinner. Thank you so much for everyone who watched and joined today for this off-schedule stream. Thank you so much, Mikael, for coming over. It's good to have you. And yeah. I think, I think I'm going to end the stream now, but I will be streaming again during the weekend, probably. Um, and yeah, and just making videos and, and all of that. So yeah, we'll, we'll catch up on Discord, guys. Thank you so much for today. See you later. Bye. Ryan Little. <laughs>